Hi, hello everyone. Welcome to GIS Madras. Today, I will show you how to create a soil adjusted vegetation index in ArcGIS. So let's get started. Now, let me show you the document for preparing the soil vegetation index and next line of audit. So soil vegetation index is used to correct a normalized difference vegetation index for the influence of the soil brightness in an area where the vegetative cover is low. So suppose if you are performing the NDVI that is normalized difference vegetation index. In that case suppose uh, a soil has with the higher brightness level may indicate it as a vegetation. So in order to solve that error we are using the technique called soil vegetation soil adjusted vegetation index. So in the soil adjusted vegetation index they used to correct the normalized difference vegetation index for the influence of soil brightness in an area where the vegetative cover is low. So, soil adjusted vegetation index is a vegetation that, that attempts to minimize the soil brightness and influence using a soil brightness correction factor. This is often used in the arid region where the vegetative cover is low. So, in Landsat surface reflectance derived by uh, soil in the adjusted vegetation index is calculated as a ratio between the red band and NIR that is near infrared values. The soil brightness correction factor of L defined it as 0.5 to accommodate the most land cover types. So L here represents the amount of green vegetation cover. Now let me show you the formula for that. If we are using Landsat 8 image and for uh, Landsat 8 and 9 you can use this formula. Suppose if we are using a Landsat 4 or 7, you can use this formula. So band 5 minus, so if we are using a Landsat 8, band 5 minus band 4 divided by band 4, band 5 plus band 4 plus 0 0.5 into 1.5. Here the 1 plus 0 0.5 indicates, first of all let me show, so in areas with the no green vegetation cover, L is equal to 1. The moderate green vegetation cover, the L is equal to 0 0.5. The area with the very high vegetation cover, L is equal to 0. So we are using a moderate green vegetative cover. So L is equal to 0 0.5. And into multiplying 1.5, the multiplying 1.5 represents this one. That is 1 plus L. 1 plus 0 0.5 is equal to 1.5. So these are the reference we are used for uh, this technique soil veg adjusted vegetation index. So let us go back to the ArcGIS section. Now go to the add section, add data and choose band 4 and band 5. That is we are required for Landsat 8. So this is a Landsat 8 image. Now add. So this is band 4 and band 5. Now let us perform the our uh, soil adjusted vegetation index technique using a raster calculator. Now go to the search, search option, click as a or type as a raster calculator. So now search. So we are required this one raster calculator spatial analyst. Click this. So wait for some time. So this is our raster calculator section. Now let us enter our our recipe formula for it. So let me show you the formula once again. So this is our formula. This one. So band 5 minus band 4 divided by band 5 plus band 4 plus 0 0.5 multiplying 1.5 so let me enter the recipe formula first of all go to the float section double click float now band 5 minus band 4 so band 5 band 5 minus band 4 so after that we have to divide it so divided by band uh, let me enter the float again now 
Now let me enter as band 5 plus band 4 so plus 1.5 so let me check that so plus 1.5 plus sorry plus 0 0.5 0 0.5 and after that we are going to use this close, uh, close the entire section using this bracket and plus here we are going to use another bracket so use this bracket and after that multiply 1.5 so let me close this to brackets brackets so this is our recipe formula to calculate the normalized adjusted that is the soil uh, adjusted vegetation index to calculate soil adjusted vegetation index this is the formula so let me run this now click ok so let me choose output location so I will choose as soil adjusted vegetation index 2 so let me save this now click ok Let's wait for some time it is running so the Rasha Casper calculator is performed so we have the worst soil adjusted vegetation index raster so let me turn off other layers now right click this our required raster go to the properties and stretched choose the color option this is the color option apply and click ok so zoom to the layer so this is our required that is our raster soil adjusted vegetation index here the blue indicates the high vegetation cover that is vegetation cover and the low the orange yellow indicates the water bodies so let me show this is the ocean part that is indicated in this color and the let me show you the reverse section so reverse are also two in this color in yellowish color and uh, vegetation covers are in indicated in in blue colors so we can classify the vegetation in different classes using the classifier section that is available in the symbology uh, we have a dense vegetation here so so here the high indicates the blue indicates the vegetation cover and the lowest value indicates the water bodies so using this technique you can uh, solve the errors in NDVI solve the errors that is uh, solve the errors that is uh, in NDVI using the soil adjusted vegetation index so please subscribe to our channel GIS Madras for more contents